Hello, I'm Marcelo Branquinho from TI Safe. We will demonstrate the creation of a payload and the infection of an SCADA supervision station using this payload. The payload will be transmitted to the target using an USB stick. For this demonstration, we'll have the help of Jan Seidel. He will use a Linux station using Backtrack 5 to develop the payload. This is the attacker machine. It's running Backtrack 5 with Metexploit 4.0. And this one is the SCADA supervision machine that we will infect with the payload that we'll develop with the Backtrack 5. Hi, we are going to use Metasploit's MEMS payload generator to generate a custom payload to be used in our demo. We are going to use a Meterpreter reverse shell to bypass most firewall restrictions, so the user will connect to us, not us connecting to the user. We are also going to apply Shikatagana encoding to avoid most antiviruses. Now the payload was generated and put into the flash drive. As we can see, we have the files of the actual payload and a file named autorun.inf that will be responsible for running the payload on the client machine. Here we have some info like the software to be run, that is our payload, uh, an action label that will be presented by the user, and a custom icon that will also be presented by the user. Both of these was crafted to uh, trick the user to think that he is doing a normal Windows operation. Next, we will start MSF client exploit. It will create a handler and listen for the incoming connection from the victim. Now that Metasploit is running, our handler is listening at port 31337 to incoming connections. I'm going to stick the USB flash drive into the victim. At this time the user is presented a custom dialog that will trick him. Stage is open and we have the session. It's important to note that most antiviruses won't notice Meterpreter because it's DLL injected and will never hit the hard drive. Most AVIDs that do hard drive scanning will never note this invasion and will not be able to stop it. Now we'll show that the uh, client security, the F-Secure client security uh, version 8 is completely up to date as you can see by the green lights here. And uh, we are also showing that the Windows XP is completely up to date with the service pack tree. And now we will insert the infected pen drive at the machine. Okay, note that it opened a window uh, telling him to open the, the folder to view the files. Uh, but this is a fake icon and uh, we produced this. Uh, the normal icon is down under here, would be that one. 
but uh, the guy would never see and probably nobody would check if this is the correct way to to run the thing so let's do what a normal user would would do so select and ok so now the application is running and the machine is being infected but uh, the user doesn't see any change and absolutely nothing is perceptible at the machine and at this point the machine is already infected uh, the antivirus didn't do anything to avoid this infection Thank you for watching our demo. You can visit us at www.tisafe.com or follow us on Twitter.